yeah, I think that is the case in any game. If you, if you don't finish off the opponent, like I said, they can get a ricochet, they can get anything. The way they play, they lumped it in the box and it comes down to luck. And at the end of the day, they've got the luck and, they, and they've got the goal because we didn't see them off. So, uh, like I said, we should have seen them off, but um, they, we've got to put it behind us now. We've got to accept that it's happened. And, there, and there's two points, uh, there's two games to play, six points to play for. We go to Burton and we want to win. Yeah, Kanzenga looks as though he'd been fouled inside the area for a penalty during that second half as well. Your thoughts on that decision? Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. I, I, I'm, I didn't see it clear enough, but like, we're not going to blame the ref. We're going we're gonna to look at ourselves, we'll analyse it, and, and we'll see how we can get better and, and we'll go to Burton with our heads held high and our, our, our shoulders up and uh, we'll get the three points. Both Barnsley and Sunderland have lost at Burton already this season. You go there for a, a massive three points now, isn't it, to, to give you a bit more of a cushion into the final game? Yeah, well, Barnsley and Sunderland aren't Luton Town, so we, I think we're much better than both of them. And, and we're going to, like I said, we're going to go there and we're going to show why we, we want to be champions. And the last couple of games, obviously, the gap's shortening Portsmouth and Sunderland game in hand next week. Is there any pressure amongst the players? Or are you just carrying on each game at a time? No, of course there's pressure. We're, we're in a high-pressure game. Uh, every game is every game is pressure. This is that, That's football, but you, you've got to have thick skin. You've got to... You've got to you got to just keep playing. You got to keep carrying on, and, and you got to keep believing in yourself that we're going to finish the job. Yeah, it's, no one said it was going to be easy. So um, listen, we're going to we're going to give it our all. We're going to our heads are going to be staying up because we're, we're still in the driving position. Like I said, obviously, it's a disappointed dressing room in there after the game tonight. But it's down to his management team and all the players together to pick themselves up ready for Saturday and realise that there's three more points up for grabs. Yeah, no, definitely. Of course, we're all disappointed. We we wanted to do it for the club, for the fans. We wanted to do it for ourselves and, and the staff and I know it wouldn't have been done tonight but five points clear would have been lovely but it wasn't to be and by the time the chat ended in there we, we all had our heads up and uh, we're all really looking forward to Saturday now. Like I said it might, might take a day or two to, to accept this but we will and, and come Saturday we'll be ready.